Time to make our city and you're watching Zonk TV. Guys, could you be able to introduce yourselves and tell us what you play in the band? Uh, I'm Patrick and I'm the vocalist. I'm Louis and I play guitar. Cool, right, so you guys are currently on tour with Polar. How's it been so far touring with the guys? Yeah, it's been pretty laughing. Like, it's been, been a good time, I reckon. Been well, good time. The show's been sick, man. Yeah, yeah anything, anything one of the proper best. good happened so far? Any good gossip for us? Or? Uh, it's early days, man. We went out last night in Leeds. It was. <laughs> You'll see videos <laughs> of it, man. There's going to be videos for it. Do we want to see the videos? videos? It sounds a bit, uh, bit yeah, dodgy. You do, you do want to see, see them? them? Alright, cool. Alright, any dates on this tour so far that you're really looking forward to playing? Any Tonight? Rarely? Tonight? Is it London? London, yeah, London. London's going to be massive. Stoke as well. Stoke the underground, it's always a good time. Cool. So, is tonight one of your favourite places to play? You know, you've played here before? We've never, never played here before. Never played before. Looking forward to it? Looking forward to it, cool. Hometown show, man. Right, so we've heard rumours that you've got a, uh, an album coming out soon. <laughs> yeah, been a long time. Can you give us any details on this? Release date, anything? Release date, okay. Well, at the moment, we're uh, in talks with the PR company, so we've got to work all that out first. Hopefully, that's going to be sorted in the next two weeks, three weeks or so. So, we're looking at about a month. Two Maybe we'll we'll have a release date out within the next month. I would hope. Cool. And are you gonna be touring for that? Uh, we plan to be here. Yeah. Right. So how's it, how do you guys feel from going from quite a small band playing little clubs to playing festivals like Heavy Fest and Hellfire Fest? How's it? Oh, you make it sound like it's been a sudden jump, man. Like it's been a long. No, road, it's been a long time. Yeah, when we yeah. first started out, guys, playing like the Twenty Seven Club, I think it was. Yeah, yeah. Well, when we when we played Heavy Fest and like Hellfire Fest, it just makes us want to get play those shows every single night man so. it's so easy to play those shows just because there's so many people a lot more energy so it's, it's gotta get them because the big shows we say put the same effort and performance every single night man. but you're stoked to be able to go play them though yeah, you're glad to be up there absolutely you know? like i know you, you've worked hard for all these years you do deserve to have it but you're That's glad fun. you finally got there yeah, yeah. right uh, and how have your live shows changed since you've got a bit bigger since your, your crowd's yeah. got it's larger energy, I think. yeah we thought thought a lot more about it we've got a better show we've got a fucking Lights, all that crap. We got loads of energy. We got so user change as well as the crowd. Yeah, got yeah, yeah. Picked up a lot more. Yeah, you pick up stuff just from playing shows, just from seeing other bands. Like what? What's your favourite one so far? Is it one of the festivals, or have you had your own gig? Yeah, that you whatever, it's heavy fest, man. Yeah, it's heavy, a good I'd one. agree with that. Heavy festival, absolutely. Cool. Ghost festival. You playing Ghost Festival, yeah? Yeah, we're playing Ghost Fest this year. It's uh, Saturday. We're main support to Heart and Hand, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Check us out, man. Absolutely. Cool. Right. So we've got some questions from fans. Connor okay. via Twitter asked, "Who would you rather snog, marry, and avoid? Susan Boyle, Haley Williams, and Justin Bieber?" Okay. Uh, Haley Williams clearly is the marry. Marry, yeah, because not gay or. But saying, do you want a woman or a dude to snog? Uh, an ugly woman. No offense. What? Susan. What? That's no way to talk about Justin Bieber. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. I guess I'd have to avoid Susan Boyle and. You'd snog Embarrassingly, just <laughs> shamefully snog Justin Bieber. Yeah. See, I'd, really, I'd just drink loads and loads of ale and have a go with Susan. Me, I'd, I'm not having. A yeah, a bag, <laughs> paper bag job, man. Yeah. See, that's <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> right, and Luke via Facebook asked, uh, "Who in the band gets the most female attention?" Steve. Steve. <laughs> Steve, <laughs> Steve. Steve gets the most female attention, yet he's too shy to come on camera. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Cool. Right. And uh, what what fans got forward to look forward to? from Cars City in 2012. Oh, new album, man. We've got a new album, new videos. We've got two more videos to come out. Loads of, loads of shows that come down to shows. Watch us, man. New cool. merch. Uh, new merch. merch. <laughs> new everything. <laughs> Does that mean new members or? No, not quite, maybe. Not having another. <laughs> Qu- maybe. Shh, don't tell Lou, man. Don't tell Lou, right, cool. <laughs> right, and to end the interview, what's your favourite thing about Liverpool? Oh, Since man. you are from around here yourselves, you have some decent favourite things. Well, what's not to like about Liverpool, man? You know what I mean? It's such the best city in the UK, man. Why? Come on, give us a reason Why? for because it. Everything's so close together. Yeah, all the people here, man. It's a it's family. Just a cry. Nah. It's not a cry. <laughs> it's not That's a what Polar gave us. Polar gave us the cry, is their answer. That yeah, we sucks. heard about that. We heard they had a pretty good night in the cray. We've had a fair few nights in the cray, to be fair. <laughs> you you played you play the cray, haven't you? Yeah, we Quite did. It was a nut show as well. It was a good time. Good one. Yeah. Cool. Right, cheers, guys. Actually, uh, do a favour just wave back. Peace, guys. Yeah. Yeah.